Judy Chicago was born July 20th, 1939 in Chicago, Illinois. She was born Judith Sylvia Cohen. Her parents were Mae Cohen and Arthur Cohen. She is a feminist artist who did lots of cool things in her life and she still is doing cool things. For example, she made many abstract works. She also did quite a few collaborative projects. Most of her, her most famous one is called The Dinner Party. The project is about a lot of women who did cool stuff and like Sacagawea and stuff, people like that. I feel bad for her because her husband died in a car wreck. They had no kids. She is a feminist activist, but she uses her art to be an activist. Her art is in lots of museums. She went to the University of California and she took classes there too. She's been trying to stop sexism for over five decades. She's been featured in eight museums and art exhibit exhibitions. She created a power play. In this series of drawings, paintings, weavings, cast paper, she brought attention to the art forms that society associates with women. She's a teacher and she founded the Feminist Workshop. The Feminist Workshop is pretty much a group of females trying to make the world more favorable for women. One of the highest compliments a female artist can get is you paint like the man, a man. How unfair is that? Why are men master artists? She has made some sculptures in her lifetime and I really think they are cool. Seeing as she is over 80 years old and still doing art, now that's commitment. There's one piece in particular I really like. It is called The End Extinction. I see it as a bear standing on a rock in the river. You might see it as something completely different. That's the best part about her art. You can see pretty much anything. The piece is definitely my favorite piece of hers. Anyway, Judy was a teacher and she's been teaching us lessons all, a lesson all along. Being sexist is wrong. And I think she's very correct on that one.